So tomorrow we're going to have a little Thanksgiving meal here, starting at 11? 10. 10-ish? Okay. There you go. <laughs> go until the food is gone. And um, so, Miguel Lugo, do you have the thought for the day? What? Good morning, family. I, <laughs> I, also, I, I just want to talk about like, I remember when I was in prison, I used to hate Thanksgiving, Christmas, all the holidays. Because I always felt like I, I was taken away from my family when they drove all the way up there to go see me. And, and uh, um, last night I even called my mom, I was like, hey, remember the day you went to visit me in, in, in the bay for an hour? She's like, yeah, I miss uh, Thanksgiving with the rest of the family. And uh, the whole thing of that is just be grateful. And don't forget, for, don't forget about all those people that sacrificed for you when you were gone. All those people that put those $20 on your books when you were in prison. All those people that, uh, that prayed for you and cried for you when you were gone. Because you're here now, so now you can make a difference. And uh, we're blessed. Well, I, I'm going to go back to why I'm blessed to just say, I wake up, I'm free, I'm able to come to work, we're able to have a place. So just, when we have this couple of days off, just be mindful of that. Be mindful that a lot of people in the world that don't have what we have. They don't have home industries. They don't have a place where they can come and eat a meal on Thanksgiving in the morning if you don't got your, your family with you. And today I get to say, I don't, have, I don't have to be the Grinch no more, you know? <laughs> I get to enjoy seeing the homies get blessed here. I get to enjoy when picking up the presents when we pass them out for Christmas, when the donors bust out and they come through for us. When they give us turkeys, when they give us all this stuff that, they, that we get blessed with, I'm like, damn, like, like people do care. Because for a long time I always get blaming the world and everything, how nobody gave a fuck about me. And I didn't give a fuck about myself, to be honest with you. But today, I get to say I love myself. I'm able to go home, be with my family. I'm able to say, I'm going to work early in the morning, be tired like Maria said, and come to work and just enjoy it. I even do, I even do a little time when I can deal with it right here. <laughs> no, but, that, but what I'm saying is, we're, we're blessed to have a, a place like Homeboys to give us those moments to give us a, a time to reflect, to give us a, a meal, to give us a check, to give us a place. And man, just thank you all for just being you. Thank you for being homeboys. Because everywhere we walk through, no matter where you at, everybody's always gonna be like, hey, you work at homeboys? Yes, I do. And say it proudly when you do. You know what I'm saying? That's right. That, that's who we are today. Today I'm not so-and-so from this neighborhood. Today I'm gonna go for homeboy industry. That's Thank you. Right.